Hey everyone, this is Ian and my channel is If Sports Cards and we have a Monday mail day for you. Uh, but before I get started here, I want to point out I had uh, posted a um, card show video on Saturday and that video also hit 100 views within the first 24 hours. That's If you don't count the giveaway video, which if you haven't subscribed yet, do that. Go to my giveaway video, put a comment in there, get entered to uh, to win some cool cards. But if you don't count that video, that's two consecutive content videos that have reached 100 views in the first 24 hours, and that is absolutely spectacular. I cannot thank you guys enough. Um, I absolutely love doing this, and it's pretty cool to see those kind of results. Um, enough of that. Let's Let's get into this. I got a lot of things I've just been kind of sitting on. Um, but I'm trying to put out some entertaining content for you guys. And I, I, before, all right. Um, I understand that this video is a mail day. It probably won't do as well as those other ones. You know, you got, you know, new release, a new product release, uh, my first hobby show, stuff like that, or my first card show. I mean, that maybe draws some additional viewers, um, which is cool. I'm, I'm not trying to always do, you know, clickbaity titles, stuff like that, but, um, you know, every every once in a while, it, it may be necessary. Uh, okay, Reaper's cards, uh, Reaper's underscore cards, I should say. He just hit 900 subscribers, and I was lucky enough to win his giveaway. Um, so these are not something I'd purchased, but they are pretty cool. Um, he gave me the choice of uh, basketball and football, and nine times out of ten, I would probably take football. But these cards were just too cool to pass up. And I don't have any basketball cards at all. Very nice uh, protection of the cards here. If you guys don't follow him already, you know, go go check out his channel, uh, Reapers underscore cards. And, uh, you know, if, if you like what you see, shoot him, a, shoot him a subscription. These cards are so cool. I remember the first time I saw one, these ugly sweater cards. Um, this was kind of the the card that made me decide to go this route. I wanted to see one of these in person. So we got a Okpala rookie. It is a rookie, right? Uh, I'm pretty sure. Uh, Admiral Schofield rookie, Prism, Silver, a Hollow. Uh, Prism, I should say, Hollow's Optic. Been watching too many optic basketball openings. A Kevin Porter. This is like a purple, I don't know if they call it a purple cracked dice or what they call it. Um, pretty cool, pretty cool card there. And we got a card out of Select, Alani Walker. That is just a beautiful card. So yeah, this this lot, like I said, I don't collect basketball, but this was a pretty cool. A um, lot of guys. And not to say I won't ever get into basketball. I do enjoy watching other people do it. I don't really know enough about it to to really, you know, talk in-depthly about this sport. But I want to put content out there that you guys like as well. But it's got to be fun for me too, right? Um, let's just get into some of these envelopes. There's uh, I, I don't know. I don't know what's in here. I cannot remember. I could have looked before the video, but where's the fun in that? Look at that. Oh, scotch tape. Not my friend. All right. I have the base. Um, Prism Draft Picks autograph of Noah Fant. This one is numbered out of 99, 23 of 99. Red, white, and blue. It's a sick looking card. Um, so pick that up relatively inexpensively. Number two. Okay, yeah. Oop, I don't want to show the address. Hopefully I didn't. All right. I ain't getting that in there. That works just as well. Oh. Just a Duggar rookie. Nothing to see here. Uh, I should talk about what's going on in the background here. 
I do have a plan for these two spots, so stick around to the end and, and you'll see what exactly I got going on here. Something happened kind of by accident, but I think it's pretty cool. This is a Kleenex. This is good in case I, you know, start crying over these beautiful cards. <laughs> Definitely a first. Well, there's all this white stuff on the card. Um, saw this pop up on eBay. Just the the green velocity out of optic. No fan PC action. Um, love the look of these cards. So snag that one. And then a massive envelope. I'm giving some auto glass company some free advertising here. Ooh, something inside of here. Oh yeah, I forgot I put I forgot I bought this card. Um if I can get it out of here, I'll show you. There we go. This must have been a, a tops redemption of some sort, but the Giants drafted this guy. First round, we'll look on the back here in a second. I'm trying to get the scotch tape off my fingers. There we go. Um they don't tell you on here. But they drafted Christian Arroyo in the first round back in 2017. This is a 1987 uh, design on-card autograph, and it's a redemption one. This one, it was only, a, I want to say, a few bucks shipped. I absolutely love this guy when he was on the Giants, and I think he's been battling some injuries. Um, shoot, who did we trade him to? I can't even I can't think of off the top of my head, but now I'm pretty sure he's with the Indians, I wanna say. And if he can stay healthy, he might he might get that second base job. I mean, I don't he was drafted as a third base, but he can he's kind of a utility guy, so um just a inexpensive card. I kinda came across on card auto. I was like, you know what? Why the heck not? All right. So I do have this massive boxing back here. Just wait till you see. I mean, unless there's something extra in here there's nothing that warrants a massive box i'm gonna try to keep this off of the card mat holy buckets all right let me go flip it down you can bunch of newspaper oh my goodness i think there's thousands thousand dollar cards that come in worse <laughs> protection than this i don't think there's anything else in here you know i got some reading material that's nice yeah all right so what's inside of there two cards cj bethard on card autograph um out of optic Rated rookie. This one is numbered out of 99. 5 of 99. And then I went to the seller's other items that he had. And, you know, for a couple bucks, throw this in there. Why not? A little PC action. Uh, Illusion, CJ Bethard. It's not numbered. Uh, or I guess not, it's not even an RPA. Just a jersey sticker auto but you know a couple bucks we'll throw it in for some pc action all right we got three left this is where things start getting a little more interesting uh these i intentionally saved these for last the i've been slacking on this guy and when i'm like looking for cards to put in the background I'm like oh you know let me see who i got for my pc cards and this guy i don't have hardly anything make sure i don't cut the card here So I uh, made an effort.
to get a couple cool ones. Look at that nasty three color patch. Big fan of Immaculate. Um, just beautiful acetate cards. Big fan of vertical RPAs. Um, on card autos. Just looking at the condition of the card, it looks pretty nice. Um, yeah. Very happy with that. So, you know, I got one decent Hawkinson for the PC now. Couple, uh, hey, we got some top series one, baby. Let's go. Maybe there's some short prints in here. <laughs> I should look. <laughs> All right, before we look at this card, no, let's see if we got any short prints here. Nope, don't think so. All right. Just had to check. Look at that. Oh, no. I messed up, guys. <laughs> I thought this was 0-1 out of 99. So now my, my whole plan is ruined. Another vertical RPA, though, out of Immaculate. Very cool card. Card looks good. Well, those two next to each other look pretty good. All right, guys, last card here. We have a Matt Davidson. I'm just kidding. I am just kidding. We really have... Get out of the way. Wow! Oh, yes. Notice the numbering, one out of 100. Oh, thank goodness. It's hard to tell sometimes, you know, corners and all that, but this card looks, looks pretty dang filthy in a good way. So this comes actually in select um, for you guys who have been watching this i have not opened any select on the channel i don't necessarily have any plans to um if i would have been able to get it on on release day i probably would have but fedex never showed up to my lcs and then i was gone that weekend so it would have been a few days late um but i really 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 wanted this card this is such a cool card i don't really have anything um to put behind here this will work Just a sick card, but I thought I was gonna have a sweet first off the line PC rainbow. I don't know what you want to call it. <laughs> Not a rainbow, I guess. Uh, just a first off the line PC of my PCs. I guess that's a better term for it. That's ninety one. Not 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 one. Dang it. Um, guess I you know the chase is still on. I got something to to still look for. But uh, this design here. Is a 1997. It may, maybe there's more of them, but there's a lot of 1997 cards like this, so it's kind of a, you know, a throwback design. And I know there's like Steve Young, Jerry Rice, those kind of guys. 
and the autographs are almost not visible anymore on a lot of those cards. So um, my plan is to definitely put it in one of these UV protecting um, one touches. Uh, hopefully that, you know, preserves the autograph. You know, maybe someday, you know, throw it in a PSA case or something. This, this would look pretty cool in that. But definitely want to make sure, you know, that autograph's protected. It's not in sunlight, stuff like that. Um, but I'm I'm very happy with this card. I was kind of nervous. A, a couple have sold since I bought this one for like 20, 30 bucks less. And I was like, oh no, did I, did I overpay for the one of 100? But uh, one just sold recently for a little more than what I got this one for. You can check out on eBay if you're curious about what that was. But uh, yeah, that's going to do it for this video, guys. Um, again, we need to do a pack wars. I'm thinking Wednesday tentatively for that. We need to get some more football on this channel. Um, it's been baseball heavy, but you know, just kind of giddy for the season. Um, but I'm going to take off guys. Thank you for watching. If you made it to the end, I, I greatly appreciate it. Um, hit that like button for me, comment. Uh, we'll interact in the comments below. Uh, I'll throw Reaper's cards, um, link to his channel in the description below if you want to check him out. Other than that, you guys take it easy.